Hi, my name is Brandy Roberts. I'm from Ogallala High School. And this is called How to Live. Monday, 6, 17 a.m., wake up stuck to the bed. Hit snooze, hit snooze, hit snooze. Last night throbs in the left side of my neck. My body is barbed wire and it clings hard to everything. 6.45, rip my body from the bed like a band-aid. Morning itinerary, wake up sister, glare at reflection, repeat and follow up with a moisturizing conditioner. 7.13, my keys are on the table next to my mom's ashtray. She is a building, cracking near crumbling, bearing the weight of a single mother, and she still tears herself apart like everything is her fault. 7.15, start the car, go to school, fall asleep on the library floor until 7.55, the bell rings. Art, weights, English, lunch, history, math, all I want to do is sleep. 10.13, stop being so lazy. I couldn't find my motivation in the lost and found. I start to breathe faster and faster. The room tilts. With every labored breath, I feel my lungs against my rusty rib cage, rusty like the nails in my dad's garage swept away in the corner and forgotten, rusty like our fireplace that huffs and puffs, rusty like these faucet eyes that leak and water and 12.50. Something tells me to keep going, to hang a bucket on my nose to catch the dripping water of my tears. My dad's voice bounces around my brain like a pinball. What are you after high school? Gonna be a wages like your mom? Gonna lose weight? Gonna be successful? Gonna do what you hate and be unhappy so I can be happy? 223. I'm dragging myself by my fingernails, dragging myself through school and work, and then I'm home. Some nights are worse than others, so instead of homework, I look for YouTube tutorials on how to ask my dad if our insurance covers antidepressants, but I can't seem to find any. I give tetanus to everything I touch, but that's not an available symptom on WebMD. I should be grateful for what I have, this body that breathes, this father that screams, this town that always brings me back. Deep inside, there is a voice full of hope, a voice that says, I can finish that math assignment, a voice that says, I can be an artist, a voice that says, I can be happy, I can be happy.